So if you're not familiar with flight test airplanes, this is what they call the power pod. So it goes in with skewers, super easy to take out, the motor's attached to it, um, attached to the firewall here. And this is a 3D printed version of their power pod, but they typically make it out of foam board and a wood piece of panel that the motor is screwed to. So basically we've got our motor, three wires, because the brushless motor, going to our electronic speed controller or ESC for short. Then that's plugged into our battery for power. And then also coming off of that is our receiver controller wire. So this wire is connected to our receiver, which is going to be talking to our transmitter right here. Okay. So then plugged into this, you see there's a bunch of different channels. You're literally not going to use that many, especially if you're using a super simple basic plane like this. This is a three channel RC airplane, which is channel number one is our motor. Channel number two is our rudder and channel number three is our elevator. Sometimes channel four, a four channel plane that would be adding on ailerons. So basically all we have to do to wire up this airplane is we need to plug in the servos first. So we'll take it, we'll plug in our rudder and our elevator. Not really sure which is which, which is which. If we have it plugged into power, we can just take and test that on our controller here. So that's our elevator stick. So coil it's backwards. So we can just take and flip those two. And you mainly have to just make sure that you get in your uh, polarity right. A lot of them say on S positive and negative. So our yellow wire is gonna be our signal. Red is positive and black is negative. So we're just gonna plug it in appropriately. And then we can shove our receiver inside of here. Next is our ESC, which is already all wired up. I'm gonna unplug this battery here for demonstration purposes. Um, so we can get this all fished inside of here and tidied up. And just like that, we've got our airplane all wired up. We got our motor, we got our electronic speed controller, and we got a receiver, and we got our servos. It's that simple, guys. Don't make it more complicated than it is. If you need help binding your receiver, your controller, there's other videos online for that. Be very safe. Do not keep your, do not put your fingers around this propeller, but we can turn the propeller on and we can feel the wind back here. If it's spinning the wrong direction, you feel wind over here, then you're just gonna wanna flip any two of those three wires go into the motor and you should be good. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. If you like this video, hit, up, hit that like button and also go check out some more of my videos on my channel. And if you like those too, hit the subscribe button. Have a great day guys, bye.